There are several legal defenses that you may be able to use to contest a speeding or a traffic ticket. Some common defenses include lack of probable cause. If the law enforcement officer did not have a valid reason for stopping you or for issuing the citation, you may be able to argue that the ticket was issued without probable cause. Mistaken identity. If you are not the person who committed the violation, you may be able to argue that you were wrongly issued the citation. How about defective traffic control devices? If the stop sign or stop light, such as uh, speed limit, was not clearly visible or properly placed or was malfunctioning, you may be able to argue that you were not aware of the violation. Now, not a defense, but a way to negotiate is necessity. If you committed a traffic violation in order to avoid the imminent danger or to protect the safety of others, you may be able to argue that the violation was necessary. And finally, entrapment. If law enforcement officer induced you to commit something you wouldn't otherwise do, you may be able to argue that you were entrapped. It's important to note that these defenses may not all be available in all cases. And really the best person for figuring out your best defense is a traffic ticket lawyer like me. If you're considering contesting your traffic ticket, you should consult with a person like me who can tell you what you have going for you, what you don't, and how to best defend yourself in court. I'm Mr. Speeding Ticket, Attorney Jay Ruane. And if you find yourself with the police on your back, I'll be by your side. Be sure to like this video and subscribe for more just like it. You can call me, text me, or DM me if you need help. I'm on socials at Mr. Speeding Ticket and online at mrspeedingticket.com.